Hi, it's me. Welcome back to my channel. Listen, today we're going to watch a movie that has been recommended to me a million times. As a matter of fact, I think it's been over a million times actually. It's um, saving, oh my god, I'm sorry, for the earth earthquake. You guys are on the bed right now, so I'm sorry. Anyways, um, it's Saving Private Ryan. It's a movie from 1998, and it's um, it's a very popular movie with uh, Matt Damon, who I assume it's uh, Private Ryan, right? And Tom Hanks, which is great news because I love him. And um, a war, a war happens. Yes. So listen, um, let's do it right now. Let's roll it <laughs> also good luck to me because this movie is like three hours long and i have no support for my back so yeah i, I don't know how this video is gonna go but i'm here i'm here i'm prepared i'm ready my back already hurts yes why is it still moving my god can you not i'm not moving what's going on Here on this day. My hair looks kinda kind of nice, so that means I need to shoot this video really fast before that changes. Also, um, since this movie is almost three hours long, I've decided I've made the uh, executive decision of doing two parts because if I don't, it's gonna take me a long, long time to uh, finish this video and post it, and I don't I don't want to do that. I wanna I want to work faster and um, I want to uh, I want to do it that way because uh, I think it will be better it's what I usually do there's gonna be two parts and that's it that's it now I'm finished <laughs> my crusty ashy hands <laughs> I don't know why my hands have aged so much in the past three years okay here we go Saving Private Ryan. We are going to save this guy today. Okay. Okay. Who is this? Mm. Where are we going? Oh, he is in a hurry. <laughs> This place looks very nice, wherever this is. Kind of makes you want to sit there and enjoy the, the view. <gasps> I was gonna say my flag, that's not my flag, but that's my home and I love friends. I live in friends. Oh wow, I like the emotion in his eyes. Oh, okay. This is a military cemetery. I've visited this here in France. A lot of these crosses have the word inconnu on them, which means unknown, and that's that's heartbreaking. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's happening? Oh, he definitely was in the war, 100%, but... Okay, now we're in the past, okay? Okay, June 6, 1944. Dark Green Sector, Omaha Beach. Is this the day of the Normandy arrival? Oh, wow. Oh wow. <laughs> oh, there he is. Oh. Ah. Listen. Realistic. Clear the ramp! 30 seconds! Got me with you! Orange right stick, starboard side stick! Move fast and clear those mo- 
murder hole. Oh no, oh my god, oh my god, this, this, this poor man. Oh my god, the anticipation. I imagine actually being here in this moment. The murder holes? Oh! 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 Oh my god! Oh my god! The the blood drops on the on the screen. Are you serious? All that heavy. Oh! Wow! This this is how. Oh my god! He drowned. Oh my god. Not that it needs it, but I love the fact that there's no music here whatsoever. That is so insane. That guy drowned. He didn't even arrive there on land, you know? Wow, wow. He he just said thank you. Wow, this is brutal. The camera movements, the lack of music, the shots are so perfect. Dude, like half of them are going to be dead before actually entering the the beach <gasps> look at the water the water is pink uh, can i ask something how young were the guys who were sent <gasps> can i show this on youtube the guys who were sent to war how young were they? Oh my god. Oh my god, is he looking... Oh my god. That's f***ed up. Oh, he can't hear. Watch out, sir. What the hell do we do now, sir? Oh. <laughs> Off the beach? <gasps> How are they gonna get out of there? My god, Jesus Christ. This is the end of the world for these people. And the people on the concentration camps also experienced a sort of um, end of times you know <gasps> the others can't do anything for him they have to leave him there how do they know where to go <gasps> Where's the medic? <clears throat> it's raining people at this point. It's raining insides at this point. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, wow. It's just a piece of person. I didn't know. I didn't. I didn't know. I didn't know this movie was gonna be so graphic. But, you know, it's, it's very appropriate. I wonder how long it took to to shoot this scene because it's like a movie in itself. Shore party! No armor has made it ashore. We got no DD flights on the beach. Dog one is not open. Mm. They're f shore party! Shore party! His face is gone. He didn't have his his face disappeared. Mm. 
did you guys see how his water container started to pour water and then blood? Wow. Jesus. Come on. Lucky pass. All right. Move it. Keep it moving. Got it? Bangalore! Clear the shingle! How can they do their job like this? I mean, it's their job, but how did they do it? He's gone. <laughs> also, I don't know what the war rules are, but how does the other um, battalion avoid killing the, the medics? Or is, does that not matter? <laughs> Practical. OMG 42 is two mortars, that 20 left 30. We gotta get this draw open. Ryben, Mellis, let's get into the war. Grab some cover and put some fire on that crew. Uh, was that Vin Diesel? Jackson, you see that impact crater? Yes, sir. That should give you complete defilade from that machine gun position. Get in there and give me some fire discipline. Wait for my command. Jesus Christ. Captain, if your mother saw you do that, she'd be very upset. I thought you were my mother. <laughs> you're not that far from me, oh lord. Perfect. All my strength. Hasty to help me. Wow, he's very good. Hard one exit! Right here! The set alone must have cost what a whole movie would cost to make. Yes, they are on a beach, but that's not what I mean. I mean all the equipment and, you know, the ships and everything. They are finding their way. Ooh. They're shooting them. They're uh, give. They're um, you know, giving up. I is that the right term? <laughs> this is a thesis on sound design. What? This is the What? I'm sorry, I can't They were surrendering. This is universal, right? The hands up and stuff. What do you say? Look, I washed for supper. <laughs> wow, that's um, that's not nice. Who am I to judge? You know, like. Hey, fish. Yeah. Look at this, a Hitler youth knife. And now it's a Shabbat Holocaust, right? <laughs> wow. I didn't know Vin Diesel was in this. Wow. Oh my god. Oh, huh. Oh, that's cool. Wow. Wow. Jesus Christ. That's quite a view. Yes, it is. Some of them didn't even 
touch land. Hmm. Is this guy important? What? Ryan S. Ryan S? What? Excuse me? What? Colonel, I've got something you should know about. Yes. These two men died in Normandy. Uh huh. This one in Omaha Beach. Uh huh. Sean Ryan. Sean Ryan. This man at Utah. Utah? Peter Ryan. Oh, is this the guy from Breaking Bad? This man was killed last week in New Guinea. Daniel Ryan. A bunch of brothers. The three men are brothers, sir. I've just learned that this afternoon their mother is going to be getting all three telegrams. <gasps> That's not all. There's a fourth brother, the youngest. He perished. That that wom that woman is gonna die. She's gonna die today. Is he alive? We don't know. Oh, that's the Ryan from the title, which is Matt Damon of yeah, of course. That poor woman. And, and what about the husband? Oh wow, this is too much. <gasps> They're coming. But how? I mean, because the title is Saving Private Ryan, right? They're gonna save him because his brothers died? Is that the reason? I didn't know that's a thing they did. Look at the brothers! Oh, that's a great shot. That is a great composition. Why? Just looking at the priest, it's over. It's over. All four of them were in the same company in the 29th Division, but we split them up after the Sullivan brothers died on the Juno. Any uh, contact with the fourth son, James? No, sir. He was dropped about 15 miles inland near Newville. There is no way you can know where in the hell he was dropped. Now, assuming Private Ryan even survived the jump, he could be anywhere. In fact, he's probably KIA. And frankly, sir, we go sending some sort of rescue mission. Flatheading throughout swarms of German reinforcements all along our axis of advance. They're gonna be KIA too. They need to try. And they need to send somebody who's already there. Not from home, you know. They need to bring that son to his mother. I have a letter here. Written a long time ago to a Mrs. Bixby in Boston. Uh-huh. Dear madam, I have been shown in the files of the War Department a statement the Adjutant General of Massachusetts, that you are the mother of five sons who have died gloriously on the field of battle. No. 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 I feel how weak and fruitless must be any words of mine that would attempt to beguile you from the grief. No amount of condecorations or recognitions are going to fill that void, you know. I pray that our Heavenly Father may assuage the anguish of your bereavement leave you only the cherished memory of the loved and lost. The solemn pride that must be yours to have laid so costly a sacrifice upon the altar of freedom. He knows. He, didn't he write that letter? Abraham Lincoln. Oh, wow. Is that a real letter? Oh, from the Civil War? Mm, this is so heartbreaking. The boy's alive. We are going to send somebody to find him. And we are going to get him the hell out of there. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm emotional already. Can't be blamed. You and I are taking a squad over to Newville on a public relations mission. Some private in the 101st lost three brothers and he's got a ticket home. They're not even sure where he is. It's not going to be easy finding one particular soldier in the middle of this whole They don't know what he looks like. They need a picture. Couldn't they make a radio transmission asking uh, him to, you know, report himself? I'm gonna go try to dig up another interpreter. The symbol of Italian motor pool on the beach. Okay, listen up. What? What are we gonna do? You're we going home here, wrapped in American flag with a hunk of cheese in your ass, Caparzo, you smart ass. No, I liked it in the ass. What? I thought you liked it in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> How can they have these conversations right after such horrendous, egregious things? How's your accent? Uh, it's just a slight one in French, but my German's clean has a touch of Bavarian. Very good. You've been reassigned to me. Grab your gear. 
Yeah, so there, are, there are a lot of Germans in the Ville. You have a problem with that, Corporal? No, sir. They know that. I've never been in combat, sir. I make maps and I translate. Oh, he is, he is um, rightfully scared. I, I, I see. Well, then get your gear. Yes. My God, he, he looks like he... Yeah, that's the type of person he looks like. Oh, he's screwed. Yes, sir. This move is going to ruin him, isn't it? You don't need to carry those. You'll need that. Isn't he responsible for that equipment? Oh, wow. Look at the scenery. This is money. Money. This is what you can. This is art when you have money. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Are the Germans there? Go, 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 go. There's civilians in there. What's the rest of Newville look like? Uh, Eagle 4 Next Ford. Box, got two Eagle buildings, Ford both sides Ford. of the street. There's Fair a lot of windows. Pass. Copy over. And then there's a wide open square with pretty good cover on the left. Here um, in France, I've, I've learned a lot about World War II. And one of the things that I learned is that when Germans invaded the small French towns, their policemen tried to stop them, but of course they were nowhere near, you know, prepared to, to do so. But that, that, that's just sad, you know, because they're civilians. Policemen are civilians. So, you know, to have to step up and face these um, evil forces must have been so terrifying for them. You know, in an effort to protect their own people. Like an old... Oh. Oh, Papa, come to show themselves. Wow. That's as if they know where the Germans are. Ils sont les Allemands. Ça va pas. Ils sont partout. Vous êtes passés par Valogne. Il faut que vous emmeniez les enfants. Oh, they want to give them the children. Yes. We can't take the kids. We can't take the kids. No. We can't take the kids. No. No. What to do? What to do? Not gonna be safe when oh, he wants to take the. Oh, that's that's. I'm I'm not I'm not sure this is a good idea. I mean, it's probably not a good idea, right? The Germans could show up right now, and it could be v very ugly. Captain, the decent thing to do is to at least take you down the road to the next town. We're not here to do the decent thing. We're here to follow fucking orders. Listen. I don't know who's right. And he got shot. He's in shock right now. He was on the ground, but we heard the shot. This is this is this is so ugly. I wouldn't venture out there, fellas. This sniper's got talent. Is Carpaso dead? <laughs> They need to give that girl back, unfortunately. She's also going to alert the others where they are. He's still alive. Hold on, Caparzo. Caparzo. I said Carpaso. Caparzo, stay still! He's just bleeding out there. Captain, can you see him from there? You stay there! Damn it, stay down! It's weird that they only shot him once. Come over here! Copy, put the head down! I can't put the head down! He wants to give him something before he dies. See, it's weird that he hasn't shot him again. It's, it's, it's to my dad. It's got blood on it. Oh, oh, no, no, I. This is so hard to watch. Saw him. Wow. Wow, he's. I'm gonna say it again, he's really good. He's crazy good. He bled out. <laughs> Just not ever going to forget that. 
Oh, oh no, I don't like that blanket. He died. He died. That's why we can't take children. Dying in a country you don't know. Fuck on it. Now they're gonna hate Ryan. It's but it's not his fault, you know? Alright. You guys just like out here for a while? Are they safe there? God damn hitchhiker out of my boot! Oh my god! Like a bunch of roaches. The wall just came down. They don't understand each other. Oh. We're up. Okay, that's um. That was the better outcome. The blood string. Oh. This movie, how is this, this movie so realistic? This is so perfectly made. Fred Hamill, Pathfinder, 101st. John Miller, Second Rangers. We're here looking for a private James Ryan. He's part of your outfit. Any chance at all you policed him up? Lieutenant, redeploy that bazooka to the right side of the road. You get Ryan up here. Oh, he's, they already found him. Here comes our boy. That's... That's not Matt Damon. Told you he was an asshole. <laughs> Sir, Private Ryan reporting is ordered. At ease. James Ryan? Second Rangers wants a word. Well, there isn't any real easy way to say this, so, uh, so I'll just say it. Your brothers are dead. He doesn't have any brothers. Order is to come get you. Because you're going home. Oh, he, he's not going home, really. Oh my god, my brothers are dead. <laughs> Is that Ted Danson? There are so many known faces in this movie. <laughs> My god, they thought their mission was over. And it's so far from that. How, how did they die? They were killed in action. I, I can't be. I can't be. My brother's still in grammar school. Oh. What, what did he think? A whole squad was going to find him to tell him that. James Frederick Ryan, Minnesota. Oh. <laughs> your brothers are not dead, dude. And also you're not going home. We're looking for a different private, Ryan. This is just a big foul up. How do you, how do you know? How can you be sure? How do you know the foul up isn't that his brothers are, are okay? And, uh, Lieutenant. Oh, sorry, dude. I gotta get home. This guy is um... Collecting some anger. Ribbon, right? What have you heard? How's it all falling together? Well, we got the beachhead secure. Problem there. Another thing I wanted to share is that um, one time I got the opportunity to go to a bunker here from World War II here in France. And um, something that struck me and um, I think about a lot since then is that um, the soldiers that were in there, they did these drawings of um, animated characters on the walls, you know, to pass time or to drain some stress. And I don't know, it's, uh, I'm gonna try to find some footage from it. It was very interesting to see, very interesting. Because it's such a, such a contrast, you know, with what they were living day to day. Oh, no, he does it. What's that? Falls asleep like that. I mean, look at him. The guy's lights out the minute his head hits the back. Well, actually, the, the trick to falling asleep is trying to stay awake. How is that way? Well, m when my mother was an intern, she used to um, work late through the night, sleep through the day. So the only time that we ever got to talk about anything was when she'd get home. So what I, I used to do, I used to lie in my bed and try to stay awake as long as I could, but it never worked because the harder I tried, the faster I'd fall asleep. <laughs> the only thing is, sometimes she'd come home early and I'd pretend to be asleep. Who, your, your mom? Yeah. Oh. She's standing in the doorway looking at me. And I just keep my eyes shut. <gasps> wow. And I knew she just wanted to find out about my day. And I still wouldn't move. I'd still pretend to just be asleep. I don't know why I did that. I actually... Wow. I bet a lot of them felt like they could open up, you know, 
in the moments of uh, tense calm that they managed to have. So where are you from, Kevin? What did you do before the war? Should he be asking this? What's the pool up to? I think it's around 300, sorry. Oh. Well, when it gets up to 500, I'll give you the answers and we'll split the money up. <laughs> also, nobody knows what he did before this. Your command to suggest that we wait until it gets up to 1,000, so. Like they have that money on them right now? I wonder if we don't live that long. <laughs> well, that's... 500. Yeah. yeah. A that's a possibility. These conversations are so dark. Newton! <laughs> Newton! I'm Newton, you know? Newton! I, um, I would do the same. I would. Some fucking genius had the great idea of welding a couple of steel plates onto our deck to keep the general safe from ground fire. Unfortunately, they forgot to tell me about it until we were just getting airborne. Gross overload. Trim characteristics all shot to hell. We came down like a fucking meteor. We were just, we were just, we were just too, too damn heavy, you know? 22 guys dead. Wow, 22. All that for a general? One man. A lot of that going around. Fubar. 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 Fubar? Fubar. Y'all got that right? Yeah, look at Fubar in the German diction. There's no Fubar in there. Uh, um, <laughs> there's more paratroops out there. Fun. I, I'm gonna have to Google that. Oh, you might want to check these out, sir. Dog tag. What do you think, Jackson? Think that little prick's in there? Well, if he is, I'm gonna find him. I have a question. If, let's say, Ryan's name is there, do they get to go home then? And when they find him, do they get to go home after that? I hope so. You know, Mike says, yeah, I swear all the guineas are buying huh? Oh, come on. You're always winning. You need a hand with that? Uh, I get a full house. I wonder how they are going to find him. You're looking at my tags, you're cheating, you know? Yeah, yeah. Oh, they are making jokes and the others. These are their friends. Right, so look at this poor bastard, I huh? think might be wrong. Sure, look what you fellas got between your legs. Oh, oh, all right, right. oh they, they need to tone it down. Jackson? All right, I got three of a kind. What the right. hell are oh, you doing? Oh, oh goddamn airboat right. watching. These are chips. All right, all right, all right. Put them yeah. back in there. I was about to ask how they can even make jokes after everything they go through. These conversations are so dark, but I think humor is a coping mechanism, you know, in situations like this. He's not here. How does he know? Ryan! Maybe the locals have seen it. Hey, you know what? Oh, he's, Probably grew, uh, uh, Ryan. he's um, Ryan. losing it. Ryan, anybody? He's completely over it. Ryan, you know a guy named Ryan? Private James Ryan from Iowa? James Ryan! Hey, Joe, doesn't uh, Mandelson pal around with a Ryan from C Company? Yeah, I think so. Well, bring him up here, would you? Wait a minute, is this like that Friends episode where when Joey started shouting, Mike! <laughs> yeah? <laughs> okay. You know Private Ryan? You're gonna have to speak up. You're sir. gonna have to speak up, so sir. Good. My hearing is not goes. so good. Oh, that's not him. Go, oh, the German yeah. grenade went up right by my head. Got it. You know Private Ryan? Who? Private Ryan, James Ryan. Jimmy Ryan? James. James Francis oh, the... Ryan. No, no, no. James Francis Ryan. Ah, that's that's that, 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 that's that's him. It was like that Friends episode. Write this down. James Francis Ryan question mark Iowa question mark. Do, do you know him? That was so random. Yeah, of course I know him, sir. Oh my god, he's, he, of course he's alive. Yeah, yeah, we missed our drop zone by about 20 miles. Ended up way over by a bumville or some damn place. Him, me, and a couple other guys were coming here to the rally point. Oh. Ran into a colonel who was gathering up men to go to uh, Ramel to babysit a bridge. That's the last I seen of him, great, sir. Great, Th thank you. Babysit a bridge? Re re Oh, okay, no, I get it. You're welcome! Assemble on me. Thank you, random guy. Listen, only one of them has died, which I don't like because um, that tells me and it makes me feel like there's a bunch of them that are going down. Hi, that's the end of part one of my reaction to saving Private Ryan. Why did I decide to shoot this outside?
the balcony. So yeah, I'm splitting this video in two parts because it's uh, the movie is too long and it would take me really long to edit it. So in um, favor of working faster, I'm gonna split it in two. So yeah, if you wanna watch part two, it's gonna be over here or here if not it's because it's not ready yet but it's gonna be soon so subscribe if you want to watch that it's actually cold out here why did i do this i'll see you in part two also if my face looks weird it's because i um i finished the movie and i um i cried a lot so yeah okay i'll see you there bye